has fallen from space. Bloop. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Dunk. What? Tails? Tails? And I'm perfectly fine. Don't know about Tails, though. <laughs> <laughs> well, Tails can fly. Screw him. You're not who I'm looking for. These aren't the Tails you're looking for. That girl's like, well, I'm sorry oh, I'm not the person you're looking okay. for. Jeez. I'm just standing here. I wonder if he's okay. Is she important? Give me that. No. She's just kind of there. She said that kind of, like, passionately, like... She didn't say anything. I wonder if he's okay. Isn't that... No, Tails did. Uh, I guess I did. did. I guess I didn't. You weren't didn't paying attention. Dialogue. No, I was paying attention. To you weren't paying attention. I didn't hear the dialogue. It's time for everyone's favorite character that I actually like, but everyone hates. Sonic, wait up! Everyone hates. Oh, it's true. <laughs> actually, not uh, uh, Amy. So Amy, this is her What's first you, new model appearance, her only previous appearance. Listen, well, not her only. Her previous appearance was Sonic CD. And she looks a lot more similar to Sonic. She, she's like a pink Sonic with, like, bangs and a dress in Sonic CD. But now she looks like this. She looks more like Knuckles, really. So she found a bird, and she's like, hey, help me rescue this bird. And I was like, I don't want to. And then she's like, well, I'm going to follow you. And I'm like, well, you disappeared the moment the cutscene stopped. So whatever. And now we're here. Here we are. In order for the plot to progress, I have to walk to a specific corner of, of this hub world. This specific corner to be specific. Corner. Oh, that's a robot. Still talking. <laughs> this is a robot. Holy crap. No problem. He's Don't want a big man, robots. Oh wait, no, I'm Sonic. <laughs> oh wait a minute. Whoa! All I have to do is look at it, buddy, and oh yeah. no, oh, yeah. what? Huh? Were you being attacked by a robot? Look here. What? It says you got to get in free. Amy. Let's go. She's supposed to be looking at a computer Are screen there. Thinking? Why did it disappear? Sorry. Amy. Go ahead. She's like a. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, she, she, she's like a ditz. Man, yeah, she's she's kind of an airhead. Yeah, just, she's not like an extreme ditz, but or maybe she is. I don't know. Um, <laughs> hey, I, what, I I've what never thought have, of her. What about the robot? I have to follow Amy. Yeah, that's kind of a weird plot so hole that happens. She Go. goes and terrorizes the town and is like, it, it's boring without Sonic here. Well, right? it's so, it's chasing Amy. You weren't. If you're paying more attention, that would be established. Are you listening to me and my clever tube? And now kill those things. Kill those things. Like that? No. Don't jump in. Oh. Don't jump in? Yeah. You wanted to grab the black one. Now you're dead. Ah, wow. Was that just a kid? No, those are robots. Okay. You want to destroy all of those and then get in the black one. I'll tell you my secrets of Sonic. Oh, just just press A. And go. Why is the black one fastest? Well, it has like the most damage resistance or something. So like other cars that run into you won't knock rings out of you. Also, if you get hit at all, oh, those ones didn't knock you out. Well, I guess the horn, orange one is high enough. Yeah, I'm still this now, so you're killing other things. I like how it actually has a little ring counter on the cart, even though you have one in the corner. Yeah, that's nice to touch. So the music that's playing right now right. is actually a remix of a song from Sonic 3D Blast. Uh. Ah! Well, that's something. I'm just gonna... I'm not sure why that happens. It's kind of a glitch. It happened to me, too. It's just like, it's supposed to be forced momentum, and you're supposed to make it across it. Take the black one. We're going fast enough. So we'll get rings before something manages to kill us. See, like you killed that one instead of it killing you. And that one too. I almost forgot we were let's play. <laughs> <laughs> Not a good thing? I uh, guess. It might lead to moments of silence, though. Moments of silence aren't really that bad. They're so bad! <laughs> no, no, no. I, I mean, 
I don't know, really. Whenever game grumps, like, if they're trying to focus, they'll start being quiet, and then they'll be like, silent grumps. After, like, five seconds of silence. I have to wonder, would, would game grumps be able to sue me just for mentioning them? They wouldn't, because they're nice guys, but, like, would they be able to? By mentioning them? No. Yeah. That's like what about saying, stealing, what like, about stealing Daniel Radcliffe, and then Daniel Radcliffe sues you because you said his name. Well, we could get, I don't know, like McDonald's or something. Could they? McDonald's! Sponsor! <laughs> that was a really crafty one. <laughs> <laughs> what if we mention the new McDonald's double cheeseburger with this side of fries that's only $2.99? Could they sue us for that? Is that new? Really? You should have I'm made something up. You should have McDonald's. made something up that existed. I know you're not. I mean, sponsor. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're not, but go down the hole. I, I didn't know. You, you, there's the hole you go down, and you weren't doing it. So I told you to. It's not what she said or anything. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a. Whoa! <laughs> That was a fun little thing that happened. Aw, oh, screw up. <laughs> cheated. <laughs> oh, rigged it. There's no real point in trying to get a strike on those. Like, the crown afterward will draw more rings, but it like does it like really slowly and spreads them out, so it's not really worth it at all. Not worth it at all. Oh, so worth it. You know, this game actually did rank you. Ha! <laughs> oh my gosh. Let me attack him, bro. You have to you know jump. What? Ah! Okay, unlike Sonic Generations, you have to actually kind of be above them to homie attack them. Right? Not just, you can't do it from below them, really. This is a pretty cool level. We're in the theme park. Yeah. It's Twinkle Park. It's and Amy Wales. Amy was like, cute couples get in free. And then she ran in. Cute. And we're looking for her by herself. We're <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> like, uh, well, I'm here with Sonic. Do we qualify as a cute couple? Yes. Uh, that's kind of dumb. Like, you can't walk, walk up and just... You'd like be with anyone and just be like, we're a cute couple, right? And they can't be like, no. <laughs> well, let's check the cuto meter. Cutometer. Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Don't bother with those buttons. Okay. I mean, yeah. You can. Press I should have bothered with the button. No, it doesn't do anything. Oh wow, this is a way of doing it. I usually just run along the side. Like you have to do right here, and like. Those buttons like make trails of rings appear and it makes you want to like light dash across them, but faster just run across and not have to charge up your <laughs> Get away! Yeah, what is it? I got a little elephant. We were looking for Amy, we found a capsule and broke animals out. And that's pretty cool. And that's no good. Yeah, not bad. It doesn't work here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, in jokes. It would suck if our little mic thing like fell out at some point. We didn't notice. It sucks Welcome so bad. to Twinkle Park. We would just edit like a segment out oh, and be like, "Sorry, shoot. folks, go watch a Amy. real let's play." <laughs> yeah, get that just go watch a real after her. Her. Just, just go away. While we figure I out. Better our catch problems. her before it does. We did so much work. We spent like seventy. Well, seventy-five dollars doesn't really seem that big if I say we did so much work. <laughs> but we spent seventy-five dollars. We had to figure all this stuff out, and we're let's playing. Three screens. In front of me. And this is, yeah, we do. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and if this doesn't like, at least like get someone that likes it, yeah, they're gonna be like, man, oh, man, I'm not funny. So we were looking for Amy, and we didn't find her, so we left. And now this appeared in that grassy field. Um, what do you do with this logic? What do you do with this? You ask. Well, I could ask to Cal, but I'm not going to. You walk over here, and you try to run through an invisible wall. Cybernet Inc. That is the most generic name 
Wow, I've actually never read that. You learn something new every day. <laughs> so, ready for a level that you might enjoy? <gasps> Speed Highway. I've played this before. In Sonic Generations. Actually, did I let you play it in this? I don't know. Uh, maybe, actually. So once upon a win, because I lent Tyler Sonic Generations, um, I wanted to show him like all the original levels, which I did, except for 06, because I didn't... Apparently my file got erased, and I didn't want to have to go through the whole game to get to Crisis City. But I showed him all the levels, and <laughs> that's a story. And now my allegory is done. I'm running kind of slowish on this. Oh wait, yeah you should. <laughs> <laughs> that was weird. I like was in the air and my feet I, were moving really quickly. I know this game has kind of wonky like running on wall physics. Yeah, I no, I I mean I kind of like it. I mean it's it better than nice. better than having completely broken walking on wall physics and that you can like slowly walk on a wall <laughs> and completely stop and you'll be glued to it. What am I doing? But honestly, that's something that I never found out in Sonic 06 until like someone else pointed out because why would I try to stop during a loop? So you can seriously walk on the walls, just like... Well, not just like any wall, but if it's like a loop or something you're supposed to walk in and like you go through it without hitting a boost pad that makes you like forcibly go through it really fast, you can like just slowly walk up and just like stand at the top just upside down. <laughs> I've seen videos of it. I think my favorite Sonic 06 glitch was in the um, Sonic Adventure um, <laughs> in the Brain Scratch comms. Uh, playthrough. I showed you this. It was a silver boss fight. Yeah, I remember. And, it, and then he got launched out of the level, and then uh, Ryan... Is it Ryan? Ah, crap. I don't know their name. It's John. It was John. Um, it's John. Crap. No, I'm not... Oh, well, you're still somehow fine. I that them. should have killed you. <laughs> um, it was like, you got outside the boss fight! <laughs> you're not supposed to do that! <laughs> so... Yeah, I would advise uh, going and watching any of those Let's Players that I said I watch because I watch them because I think they're good. So I would advise watching them. This is cool. It reminds me of the Dead Fantasy like fighting scene. Oh, when they're going down the thing. Yeah. Well, this came out first. I know, but it's it's the same sort of thing. Like, I wonder if he even took inspiration from it because there's like pillars blocking their way. That well, let's hope so because I like when people take inspiration from Sonic because it means Sonic's good. <laughs> So here's a part that isn't translated to Generations at all. Actually, you've probably already seen it in section. So. Whoa! One thing that Sean and Scott couldn't figure out was don't hit enemies when they're electrified. Because they hurt you. You don't kill them. <laughs> I'm going this way, I guess. By the way, those cards will hit you. Unlike the Adventure Field ones. So, that's something to watch out for. You can go that way. Not up there, though. I thought it was like a bounce pad or something. You know, for how like linear your path is in this segment, it actually has a lot of different routes. Jump in the fountain just cause... What? Is this place? Nice. I actually... I don't think I've ever used that fountain to get up there. I just can't manage yeah. to do it. I don't know why. Cause uh, I suck. Oh, cause you suck. <laughs> I said it first, you're not funny. Because you're not good. 